ए बी सी इज एन इक्वलेटर ट्राइंगल एंड ए सर्कल पासिस थ्रू ऑल इट्स वर्ड्स द लेंथ ऑफ ईच साइड ऑफ द ट्राइंगल इज टेन वी आर सपोज टू फाइंड द रेडियस ऑफ द सर्कल टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम वी आर गोइंग टू यूज टू कॉन्सेप्ट वन रिलेटेड टू इक्वलेटर ट्राइंगल्स एंड अनदर रिलेटेड टू सर्कल्स In any equilateral triangle if we draw a perpendicular from any vertex to the opposite side of the triangle this perpendicular will bisect this side and this perpendicular will also bisect this angle so let's draw a perpendicular from vertex a on side bc of this triangle let's call this point d so this means bd will be 5 and dc will be Five as well. Also, this angle and this angle will be equal, which means this angle will be thirty degree and this angle will be thirty degree as well because this angle is sixty degree because this is an equilateral triangle. Now let's talk about circle. If this is a chord of the circle and this is the center, and if we draw a perpendicular from the center of the circle to this chord. then this perpendicular bisects this chord so here bc is a chord of this circle d is its midpoint so it means ad passes through the center of the circle because of this concept now let's apply this concept again and if i draw a perpendicular on this side from vertex b it should also pass through the center of the circle and this angle will be 30 degree now in right angled triangle bdo cos 30 degree will be equal to base over hypotenuse which means it is bd over bo this implies square root 3 by 2 is equal to bd is 5 and bo is the radius of the circle this implies radius is equal to 10 divided by square root 3 that's my answer now if you really like this video then please share it with your friends and your classmates thanks for watching mathemafia